Hey, we have here another integral from MIT Integration B. This is from 2010. Problem number nine. We have the integral of dx over x times x to the fifth plus one. Okay, I think if I could help it, I want to avoid partial fractions. And what I'm going to do to start, let's take this x and bring it into the numerator here. Okay, and doing that, what I'm actually trying to set up is I'd like to do a u substitution. And I'd like, I'd like to make it where my whole denominator is u. Now you notice, I don't want to do it yet, because if we make u equal to this, if we make our u equal to x to the fifth plus one, derivative is going to be 5x to the fourth. Not really a great match for what we have there. But what I can do is let's rewrite this denominator. I can factor out an x to the fifth. So how I'm going to rewrite this, we'll factor out x to the fifth. And then we'll notice this is going to be uh, 1 plus x to the minus fifth. So let me just rewrite this. But now the nice thing here is we have these two x terms. We have x to the minus 1 over x to the fifth. And we can do is we can just combine those. We can divide this and write this as x to the minus fifth in the numerator. So multiplying those two together, we're actually going to have in the uh, numerator, we're going to have x to the minus 6 dx over 1 plus x to the minus 5. And so now that we have it like this, I'm going to do my u substitution for the whole denominator. We'll make this our u. So we're going to say u equals 1 plus x to the minus 5. And then we'll take our derivative. D, derivative of 1 is 0. Derivative here is just minus 5x to the minus 6 dx. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to make my numerator match this exactly just by multiplying by minus 5. But so that I don't change it, we'll multiply by a minus 1 fifth over here. So we're actually just multiplying by 1. Okay, so now I can substitute. We'll still have our minus 1 over 5. Numerator, like I said, is going to be du. Denominator is going to be just u. This is going to give us minus 1 over 5, natural log, absolute value, u. But then I can just back substitute here. We're going to have minus 1 over 5, natural log, 1 plus x, minus 5. So I think this is perfectly fine as an answer, but what I'm going to do is I'm just going to manipulate it a little bit to get it into the same form that MIT had it. So what they did is they simplified what's inside here. So they, they wrote this 1 as x to the 5th over x to the 5th. And x to the minus 5 is just 1 over x to the 5th. So adding these two together, we have x to the 5 plus 1 over x to the 5. One last thing we're going to do is I'm going to take this minus sign and use it as an exponent in the natural log and then use it to flip it and get the reciprocal. So for their answer, they have 1 over 5 natural log x to the 5 over x to the 5 plus 1. So that's it. We'll stop it there. Thanks everyone for watching. Have a great day.